back to another video, click the five jewel here, where today I am back playing um Minecraft. But there is a twist. I set it to an old world, which means there's a border. It's kinda like in Java Edition where you can set the world border apart from I can't change it. So there's just gonna be a random border where it looks like it's glitching, but it's not. It's really there. I'm just hoping that there's an end portal here. Because otherwise I won't be able to complete the game. I'm just gonna start by punching a tree because that's how you start every game of Minecraft. Okay, that was glitched because it didn't look like it was mining. You know what? This is actually a perfect place to build. I'm also not as used to using PC as I should be, even though I have Minecraft, I've had Minecraft on my PC for like a year now. I still don't know how to use it properly. This is also way too big. Okay, I'm just gonna punch another tree down. Normally I would like explore first and then try to build a house, but um, I'm on normal, I'm not changing it, and um, yeah, I don't think I'm really going to be able to get lost, because <laughs> it's not very big. Well, it might be big. But there's a border, so I'm not going to go too far. Oh god. Basically the point of this was... Um, to have set boundaries that I can, can't just build wherever I want and I probably won't be able to find an ocean monument if there even is an ocean around here and I'll have and I probably won't be able to get every single resource so yeah, that's pretty much the only problem I'm gonna have is not being able to get all the resources but I should be able to get the basic stuff like obsidian and stuff so I should be fine I also did change my character I now have a bun Or a curly ponytail, as it's called. Mm, okay, I'm gonna need an axe, a sword, and I need to shift click because that makes it so much easier at times. I mean, I could use wooden swords at times. Oh, what if I found my. I'm probably not gonna find a mine shaft, but what if I do? There's a horse here. I'm gonna kill it. Give me leather. Didn't even tree give me anything. Is this really? Oh, and it's also set to caves and cliffs. So, uh, I mean, the items I'm gonna find aren't gonna change, but the caves are. So, last time I played um, the caves and cliffs, everything was waterlogged. That was great. I hope they've changed it so that nothing is so that it isn't doesn't waterlog as much. Okay, there's a cave over there, and it looks waterlogged. It's also really, really small. <laughs> What's the point in this? Dang, I wish I could tame that one. I also need to be careful when shift clicking. I don't need two doors, so I'm gonna get rid of this door. Or well, this doorway, because I don't have a door yet. I, I, I want to punch this dog, which sounds really cruel, but it be, I, want, I have no bones and it's just, I feel like it's gonna get in my way. So instead, I'm just gonna punch this dog. Oh, shot this horse, so I'm not really sure. Yep, this definitely is not glitching. This this is this is the world border. And it looks like that if I do find I can't even I can't even get up. <laughs> I can't even get up onto here. Wait. Okay, good. I can't swim out of the world. Okay. Why did I even try that? I don't know. 
I just hope I can find axolotls in this very small space of water. Cut. Am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Oh my god, I'm stuck. Uh. Um, help. The game is glitched and I'm stuck in the water. Okay, I'm out. Oh, I thought I was gonna die. Either by drowned or by drowning. Okay, so it looks like I have... A, there's a tiger biome over there. Savannah over there. Desert over there. Which is all very handy because um, now I can get cactus and other kinds of trees. Even though acacia is completely useless to me. Also, my most, um, my most useful resource is probably going to be mob farms. Because they're probably the thing I'm going to be able to use the most. Oh, I just realised I have very limited amount of clay, so if I wanted to make something out of terracotta, I essentially couldn't. Dang, that sucks. Also, diamonds are going to be so hard to find. I'm probably going to, like, mine the entire chunk beneath me. Why did I build this so big? It isn't even that big and it's too big. Get any food. Um. Oh, this probably isn't going to be a village, is there? I haven't even found a sheep yet. I, I can already tell I'm going to struggle. I mean, I haven't even made a pickaxe yet. Why, why did I just punch that cow? I have a sword. I probably shouldn't do this, but it has no negative effect on me. It probably would have been worth it to cook it. But... Oh well, it's too late now. And the sun is setting, I'm on wooden tools, and I'm most likely going to die. Oh well. It's not like I'm going to spawn in the middle of nowhere, at least. That's the one perk of being in this very small world. There is no such thing as getting lost. It's, it's literally impossible. You just walk around for a while and then you'll find your way back home. Okay, I have found no sheep. But I do have enough wood to finish my house. I just don't have any torches. But as long as I stay in my house the whole night... Wait. <gasps> oh my god, yes! This wolf is my saviour. I have one piece of wool. Um, he may be not entirely my saviour, but you get it. At least I have one wool. Actually, now that I think about it, there's coal right here. Hang on a second. Let me make a... Um... Why am I forgetting what this is called? Let me make a pickaxe. So I can make a torch. And then I can light up this place, and I won't die in the middle of the night due to a mob spawning right next to me. <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna make the rest of this wood into sticks. I don't need to finish my house yet. I can just light everything up and just hide. And mine the coal. Did- what? <laughs> This is why I don't like my laptop. It's probably the most glitchiest thing I've ever used. Did I say the most glitchiest? I meant the glitchiest, not the most glitchiest. You know, the more I say it, the more confusing it gets. I'm just going to stop speaking and keep mining. You know, this is probably the first video I've ever made where I haven't looked at the time that, th that this has been playing for an entire nine minutes. Okay, 16 torches. Definitely not enough, but definitely probably worth it. You know, just as long as no creeper spawns near my house, it'll be fine. Away. Let me light this place up first, and then I'll kill you all. No, no. You know, one thing I hate about skeletons is that they always have long range. I'm staying in here. I 
feel like a baby in all of those Minecraft roleplay videos because they always have wooden swords. And as they grow up, they end up having diamonds, which is kind of true. But yes, so I want to see them. Stop fighting with He's got a stick. No, I want to see the fight. Who's gonna win? Probably the skeleton, because the zombie can't even reach the skeleton. Oh my god! Go yep, it was it was the skeleton. The skeleton one. No, 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 no! I got, I got, I, I got killed in midair. Oh great, I'm in the middle of nowhere. Well, I'm not in the middle of nowhere, but I'm in the dark, so. Ah, oh, dang it! I forgot about husks in the desert. Why do I have to live so close to a desert? Well, why did I just? Oh my god! You know, th this is probably one of the down perks of having multiple swords on you. Th the mobs can pick a bunch up and leave nothing for you. Uh, you know what? At least they're wooden swords and not diamond swords. Oh god. Uh... <laughs> no, I died again! This knight is being so harsh on me. And there's a witch as well. Wow. You know, this is why, this is probably why my sister will never ever play on anything more than easy, unless uh, it's keep, keep inventories on. Okay, how many of you have my sword? Give me back my sword. Oh god. Give me back my wood. Why would you even pick it up? It's useless to you. What are you going to use it for? Knocking people out? Which isn't even possible, because this is Minecraft. Where's the other ones that had my swords? I mean, I don't need the swords, but... Where's my pickaxe? I think it's in here. Yeah, it moves in here. Oh my god, there two of them again! At least this time they don't have wooden swords. Oh my god. Not the husks! Why are the husks coming over here? Why are they coming over from that far away? Am I really that close to the desert? You know, one of the good things is the fact that it's going to be so easy to light up the entire island. I'm just going to make a run for it. Oh my god, why is there so many zombies? I mean, this is Minecraft, I get it, and zombies are like the most common thing you can find, but still. How come I've only seen two creepers this entire night? But make that three. <laughs> Normally, I'm, I'm seeing like five creepers at a time. Like, turn one way, there's two. Turn one, turn another way, there's another creeper. There's only like three. Okay, so that's that's a really tall mountain. Okay, so there's some flowers over here. The other end of the world. I haven't seen a single cave, but then again, I haven't climbed the mountain, so that's probably where the caves are all going to be. Um, you know, I'm actually terrified. <laughs> also, there's there are so many good places to build. You know, I honestly expected it to be smaller. I thought that was a cave, just hanging off the edge of the world. One thing I wish you could do is just walk ever so slightly to the left, like almost as if you're shifting off of it, and then you will be able to see what's on the other side, like whether there's any caves down there, or lava. That'd be so cool. No, no! No, not again! This time I really would be in the middle of nowhere! Oh god, no, 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 go, go, go. There's a creeper! And another- Why is there so many skeletons?! Go away! Go away! Thank you. No, no! Stay away, creeper. No! Dang it. No! Why? What, 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 like, what am I gonna do? I'm essentially just gonna have to run around the entire night, avoiding everything and everyone. That's a baby zombie. Oh god. <clears throat> yeah, but I better, I better start running even quicker. Before that thing sees me and starts to charge towards me like a tiny horse. I don't know. I guess it wouldn't be a horse. It would be more like a tiny child who's just seen a sweet and their parents have just said that they're allowed to get it. 